Hello, and welcome to my studio. I'm Kurt Bruegel, and I have a passion for drawing. In my profile is a link to my website, kurtbruegel.com. Join me, follow me. Every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, when I open up my doors to the studio, let you in, give you a peek, an insight, if you will, to what I'm working on. And uh, if you have questions, feel free to ask. And on Saturday, I uh, headed out to the local State Creek Park, Brandywine Woods, and uh, set up my easel and drew my little heart out. So this is a scene from the Brandywine Woods when I started. Um, I start all my drawings with just a lot of scribbling. This is direct Prismacolor pencils to Strathmore um, tan tone paper. And uh, so today I want to finish this up and uh, we're going to work on some details. Do, do, do. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Thank you. Welcome to my studio. This is all freehand, yes. 
Hello, New York City. Thank you very much. There you go. Closer here. They do portraits very well. Trying to get a steadier cam there. Okay. This is a uh, view from a local woods near me called the Brandywine Woods, Brandywine State Creek Park. On uh, this past Saturday, I went out and uh, drew live, set up an easel, my camera here on Periscope, and drew live. So I brought it back into the studio, and now I'm finishing it up. So it's pretty loose right now, which is my style. Getting started, I just scribble. I got into art as a wee lad. I've been drawing as long as I can remember. Mm -hmm. Well, the only way you get good at it is by doing it. <laughs> if I, uh, yeah, just grab a piece of paper and start drawing. I don't know where you're at, but the, where I'm at, we have some beautiful weather, a lot of sunlight, just rain last night, the sun's starting to come out. Just grab a piece of paper, a pencil, keep it simple, just start scribbling. Just start drawing. Don't worry about trying to make art. That's all this is. It's just scribbling. Thank you very much. This is uh, my magic 
eraser. <laughs> My secret weapon, if you will. Don't be afraid to erase. Erasing is drawing. Half of all erase all the drawings are erased. Good ones, that is. If you're interested in seeing more of my work in my profile, yes, very peaceful. In my profile is a link to my website. You can see more drawings of mine. Always feel free to ask questions. No, nah, no water. This is just a, a path. I was right over here. And then this is a path that keeps going along. It's a whole bunch of trails in these uh, woods. Called the Brandywine Woods. And I just go hiking ever so often. Just take pictures, but... Uh, I've been talking about doing um, a live drawing session, so finally got my button gear and went out there and did it. I'm so glad I did. It was 
wonderful time. I'm going to do it again very soon. I do sell them. I am a professional artist. This is a study I'm doing a series on called Women of the Woods. You can see a whole bunch of them at my website. There's also the replay videos here. You'll be able to see some stuff. I do sell. Getting ready for a really big show in October this year, 19th to the 23rd, IXCon, LXCon, largest gathering of fantasy artists in the world. So it's going to be a great time. It's going to be a Reading, PA. at the Google Works Center, October 19th through the 23rd. I'm going to be in the Evening Artist Showcase. It's my second year, so I'm super excited. Uh, Pennsylvania. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Sort of a uh, Toulouse Lautrec meets Pierre Bonnard. <laughs> If you have any uh, art history background or interested in art history, two fantastic artists. Toulouse Lautrec. Really didn't do a lot of uh, outside scenes. Bonard. Do -do -do. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to be doing that in a second again. Just looking for some more blue. Just want to get a little bit. Oops. One of the secrets to my drawings is just really hold off for the details until everything else is established. Composition, value, once all that's established then you start in adding in all those fancier bits. Mm -hmm. Thank you.
here we go. A little bit of racing. The thing about colored pencils is that once you get a, about three layers um, on top of each other, colored pencils, um, other than darker colors, they're hard to keep layering on, which I like. I like. It's not a criticism. It's more of an observation. Also see a lot of light come through too. All right, wow, gone over a little bit, 20 minutes really into the drawing. I want to thank you for joining me today. I am Kurt Bruegel. I have a passion for drawing, and my profile is a link to my website, kurtbruegel.com. Follow me, join me every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, 9 a.m. Eastern, either here in the, you're very welcome. Thank you for joining me, staying with me through the whole whole 20 minutes and that's what it is it's 20 minutes in my studio see what's happening what I'm working on ask questions be inspired and as always take 20 minutes of your own time today a piece of paper and a pencil and draw something thank you so much bye-bye